my name is Cameron Smith. I'm a ski bum, trying to work my way up into the big leagues with freestyle skiing. I started skiing when I was about three years old at a resort called Silver Star. I was always a little daredevil, so skiing was a perfect fit for me. Right now I'm living in uh, Whistler, BC. I moved here in November 2011. Uh, Whistler is the place to be for freestyle skiing, so it was, you know, right when I graduated I knew it was the place I wanted to go. I started freestyle skiing when I was about 13. Um, a lot of my friends were joining the program and, you know, it was just a fun weekend thing to do. Uh, Silver Star influenced my skiing in many ways. Uh, first of all was the friends I had there. Um, every weekend, you know, it was relaxed, but we were always pushing ourselves, like always trying new things. So they, they were a great help. And also was the freestyle skiers we looked up to. You know, when I started freestyle skiing, all the big names were there. Here comes TJ Schiller. Temporary tornado, stop it, buddy. Oh my God. What the this is Justin Dory from Vernon, Canada. And Dory's in hot. The double cork 1260 right off the bat, straight to his feet, well grabbed. Growing up in the sport, just being able to watch them, it was a huge inspiration to like, keep motivated and always know, you know, like, why can't that be me? Whistler is very different from Silver Star. Uh, it's just the, the next level. All the jumps are bigger, the terrain's bigger and the riders in the park are always doing stuff you'd never see at Silver Star. There's so many up and downs with freestyle skiing. You know, it's a hard impact sport. You're definitely hitting the hot and cold tubs as much as you can, getting to the gym and keeping yourself healthy. Yeah, so I've got competitions coming up. So I'm just trying to, you know, got to keep the body healthy, first of all but also I'm doing a lot of trampoline work so I can you know, get those trampoline moves on snow and have them dialed for the upcoming events. Yeah, we're here at the Whistler Gymnastics Center. Gonna do some Friday night bouncing. I can wait at the canvas corner, now I'm back away. I'm trying to be on the hill as much as possible. Uh, the more I can get out, the more I learn and the more I can clean tricks up and uh, get them dialed in for the events. It's a cloudy day, so we're working on some rails and uh, a few little jumps. Yeah, so the Canadian Shield's coming up, and it's a pretty high-level event. There's $5,000 for first place, and I would love to get that first place. But, um, you know, a lot of good riders, so I'm just going to have to perform my best. So the night before the event, I'm just getting all the equipment together, keeping the skis maintained. I usually just like to relax before a competition, get a good night's sleep, nice big supper. 
keep it chill. Uh, here at Mount Seymour, it's competition day for the Canadian Shield. Uh, a little behind, but uh, I'll get there, get in, get a few training laps, and then uh, go down a few runs. I think for my run, I'm going to be doing two seven nose tap on the down flat down, and uh, first jump will be switch right cork seven tail, and then for the second jump we switch left cork seven nose. Oh, it is really, really, really foggy right now. It's, uh, it's interesting though. Uh, you take off the jump and it's just kind of like dropping out of thin air onto the landing. Just landed my first run. Uh, I feel pretty happy about it, so now I can, you know, work on a bigger trick on that second jump and hopefully get a switch ten. Fourth place, Cam Smith. Yeah, yeah. Cam. Yeah. Yeah. Competitions aren't the biggest thing. They always have a lot of pressure and involves you throwing your biggest tricks. What I love is just being out on the hill, sunny day with all the friends and you know, just doing laps, not really caring about sending the biggest stuff, just having fun. Oh no, what we've been learning and learning from Everybody want romance Everybody want safety Safety love Everybody want comfort Comfort love Everybody want me Skiing is just something I'm, I can look forward to, that I'm motivated for. Everyone needs something in their life to push on day to day. Just with freestyle skiing, I have something to look forward to in every day.